The following video is not made for kids under 13. If you are not 13 years old, please exit out of the video now. And please, YouTube, do not sue me. Hey guys, Leon Mookie here, and I'm back with another part of What If Izuku Was a Villain? This is going to be part 14. So, where I last left off, let's get into it. With the sport, with hearing about Ingenium, he basically just chalks it off as, and also worried about Ida as well. He just moves on and starts to prepare to spare training by meditating. Soon after, he gets a message from Shigaraki telling him to meet him at the bar as soon as possible. Izuku here getting the message, he messaged him back and says he'll be on his way. Then after, but then his mother tried stopping him and asking him on where he's going to be going, say, saying that he's going to be out training for a bit. He, his mother after and said that he'll be back as soon as possible promise after what happened at the sports festival and him and her seeing her own son looking maniacal and everything she is a little worried about him now especially with for before enrolling in ua him being missing for a week or so he he create he uses enhanced body to move as fast as he can soon after he arrives in hope he arrives at the bar at no time flat, about at least 10 minutes or so. Shigaraki is still a little bit annoyed that he still took his time. As Izuku said, I'm sorry master, it does take a while to get from my place to over here in such a short time. As he sees a man covered it with blades and covered with a sword and, two and knives around his sides and also wearing a bandana over his eyes. So realizing who, asking on who this man is, as Kuragiri tells him, this is the illustrious hero killer named Stain. So, realizing on who this guy is, this is the same guy who put Ingenium in the hospital and also ended his career as the, her as the hero Ingenium. Most likely, and what, as Stain asks, Who's the kid? I didn't expect the here. I didn't expect the League of Villains to add kids to their ranks. As Izuku introduced himself, my name is Izuku Midoriya. I'm a spy for the League of Villains. I go to UA. As he, Stain realizes what his work realized, that he realized what Izuku says and tells, "Wait, you're a spy." You're going to a hero school and giving out information that the League of to the League of Villains. Well, that's that's surprising. As Izuku is wondering, as Izuku tells him, "I'll do anything to erase this hero society. Anything." He's staying, staying wondering. So, wondering on why he's truly here, and as and as both and as Shigaraki. What is your conviction? Why do you lead the League of Villains? And Shigaraki gives him his same answer that he did in canon, saying that he just wants to destroy anything that annoys him and get rid of All Might. Simple as that. He's staying saying, do you not have any conviction? Any, any dream that you want to see you become a reality? Is that only, are those the only things that you want? Stain getting a little irritated hearing this. What else is there? As he prepares using some of his not prepares bringing his knives out, Izuku said, "Wait, please, Lord Shigaraki has more than that. I promise." Stain put takes his hand away from his knives and says, "Okay then. Then what about you, Midoriya? What do you? Why are you here with the League of Villains? What is your conviction?" As Izuku tells him that I do have a dream, a dream to re to end this false hero society, a society where people only care more about fame and fortune, 
and let and don't even do their best to save here save people no matter what i will do any i will do whatever it can even people who don't even have quirks can be heroes that's what i that's the hero society i want to build as he's as staying hears these words he, he begins smiling saying is that so you truly are somebody I can relate to. I can understand. As, but however, Izuku didn't finish telling him that he also wants to see All Might dead and kill him with his own hands if need be. Soon after, he wonders, why do you hate All Might? If anything, he's the true pinnacle of what a hero should be. As Izuku says, wrong. He's a, he's a liar, a fake, a complete and total a complete and total fake hero. I wanted to save somebody, and, and then I was ridiculed, put down by All Might, even though I'd done more to help where, where all the other heroes stood by and done nothing. Stain, Stain realizing this, he, that his own hero that he looked up to, that he saw as his worthy, as, as the worthy hero, would say such words to this young boy, a boy who wanted to be a hero so badly, he feels a little bit conflicted, but also understandable, saying that, well then, I guess it makes t- I guess there are some things we, fo- we can't fully agree on, can't we? But, but I do agree with your ideas to change this hero society for the better. So, I guess there's one thing. I guess we can. I guess I will join you. As soon after hearing, as soon after Stain said those words, All for One began talking through the TV saying, Wise choice, Stain. Wise choice, Stain. You've made, you will be a great addition to the League of Villains. As Izuku began saying, Master All for One, I didn't know you were listening. And him saying, Yes, I was, my boy. So... I'm glad that you are the one to convince Stain to join us. As Izuku said, your words are too kind. Soon after, Shigaraki gets a little bit annoyed, saying, do we really need somebody like him to join us? As All For One tells Shigaraki, yes, we do. He's He's important. We need people like him who have dreams and convictions that can motivate people. As Shigaraki says, whatever. Soon after, Izuku tells him that he has to leave as soon as possible. Doesn't want to worry his mother. And Shigaraki tells him, fine, just go. Make sure that, also, make sure that you tell us what, what internship you'll be at. Got it? As Izuku says, promise, master. Stain also says that he'll be leaving as well. He still has more false heroes to purge. And Izuku saying, I hope one day we we will fight together, Stain. And Stain also agrees with the young with the young villain as well. And they both part ways. Soon after, Izuku rides back home. As he now finally has somebody he can truly call his ally. And that's it for this one. Thank you guys for watching. For watching this video i really appreciate it please leave a comment and say what you guys think below i want to i want to hear them also i might plan on making a new what if series so look forward to that guys and uh, and i'll see you guys next time this is yamoki signing out later